please. Please don't let it be Hardcastle. Not Hardcastle. All rise for the Honorable Milton C. Hardcastle. Said. Very good, Your Honor. We got a couple of new guys hanging around the park. One of them used to jump center for Fremont. Want to come around after work? Be my pleasure, Milton. Now nah, you're cooking. This guy is going to give me 20 years. You watch. Look, be polite, okay? Let me do all the talking. I got a good strategy. Relax, we'll do fine. All right, be seated. Well, welcome back, Mr. McCormick. Got anything to say for yourself? What am I supposed to say? Nice to be back or something equally profound? Uh, uh, Your Honor, I'm Steve Miller. I'm counsel for the accused. I'd like to file two pretrial motions. Now, well, just climb down off your trike, Mr. Miller. You're going to get your chance here in a minute. Huh? Climb down off my... What the hell is he? I don't allow swearing in my courtroom, Miller. You do it again and you're in contempt. Hey, how's our strategy doing so far, huh? Good. Uh, Your Honor, uh, I apologize for my impudence, and I'd like to take this occasion to assure the bench that I will not again transgress. All right, son, just don't slobber on me. We all do it once. Don't do it twice. You want to sit down now, please? Uh, set! You got him on the run. No doubt about it. How long have you been on the streets this time, McCormick? You mean how long since I was released from prison? Yeah. It's been about six months. To be exact, it's been five months, 26 days, 13 hours, and about 16 minutes. It's a cute bit, Judge. I've been hunting around all morning for a laugh. Thanks. Uh, Your Honor, if I could uh, ascertain uh, the direction of this line of questioning, it seems a bit unusual. No, there's nothing unusual about it, Mr. Miller. Before I send Mr. McCormick here off to camp again, I'd like to know what's been going on. Well, uh... My little brother Timmy's doing fine, and uh, Ma had her appendix taken out. Uncle Zeke, he's still up in Saugus picking lettuce, and you're still about the biggest donkey in America. I'd like to see the prisoner in my chambers right now. Yeah. Your Honor, don't I... Object. I... Don't do anything, all right? I want to talk to this guy. That's all right, Sid. You don't have to cuff him. If he tries to take off on me, I'll give him a new hole to look at. Well, I've been kind of interested in you, McCormick, quite some time. At least long enough for me to get a nice little rundown here on some of your past activities. Some of it's guesswork, but it's pretty accurate, too. For instance, we got Florida 1978. <laughs> Looks like you avoided arrest for two days. Stealing cars again, weren't you? I was repossessing them, Judge. It's a small point, but hey, you know, let's keep this honest. Two. You know what I got here? More Lone Ranger comic books? What I got here, wise guy, is 200 cases that came in and out of this courthouse. Every one of them was guilty, and every one of them walked away clean because of legal technicalities. Sometimes witnesses disappeared. Sometimes they died. Want a peanut? No, thanks. I hear they cause mental retardation. But here, go ahead. Help yourself. Hmm. Case in point, James Buchanan Smith. Cocaine dealer. Now, this guy's got more white lady coming across the border than anybody in the country. Two. L.A. cops catch him dirty, but when a cop gives him his Miranda, he neglects to read it from the card. So, the defense attorney gets the cop to admit that in court. Seems that if he gave him the Miranda from memory, maybe he left out a phrase or two. That cop can't swear he didn't, so the Miranda doesn't stand up and the case gets thrown out of court. Gene Frechette, mob killer. Here's one for you, Judge. Mark McCormick, car repossessor. He buys himself a Porsche, but he puts it in his girlfriend's name because the insurance is cheaper that way. But they have a beef and she throws him out. Then poor Mark goes and gets his own car back, but she has him arrested for grand theft auto. Then lucky Mark gets an eccentric judge who puts him in prison for two long years. You were guilty. You stole that car. It was my car to begin with. Lady Justice is a tough old broad. 